Hey, I'm Carl with Apt, and we've got a very interesting product here for you today. It's the Creo Pop, and no, it's not a boy band from Croatia. It's actually a 3D pen. So this thing is, uh, it's pretty cool. I'm not a very artistic person myself, but uh, we've kind of been messing around with it here in the studio, and we'd like to show you a little bit uh, about how it works and what it does. So this is the pen itself. It actually comes in two parts. There's the top part with all the controls on it, and then you have the bottom part where you're going to put your ink cartridge. So the ink cartridge slides in, and then you put the top on and twist it so that it uh, connects there. And so you twist it in, it's gonna lock into place, and then you're basically ready to go. So there's this controls are simple. There's two buttons on here, one's for power, one is to select the speed of, uh, of the pace that the ink comes out of the pen itself. Uh, and there's a few different modes, so you have a a uh, filling mode which is gonna send the ink out really fast and that's gonna be if you're filling something in that you've already drawn. Uh, there's also a light only mode which is used to help cure the ink that's coming out and then you have the basically a combination mode where the ink is coming out and the lights are on so it's drying it as you draw that is going to allow you to basically create your 3D works of art. Um, mine would certainly not be considered works of art but they are uh, 3D. So <laughs> we'll show you uh, show you how the pen works here. So to do the regular mode, you're basically going to hit the power button, and you'll see the little LED light come on here. And then there's a little timer button underneath that you press to select the speed at which the ink is coming out. So I am a novice, so I set it at the first speed, which is going to be the slowest speed. So you to start it, you hold down the button until you see the light come on, and you'll hear the motor start running, and then the ink is going to start coming out. So we'll do that. And you can see the ink starting to come out here. And off you go. You can start designing then. When you want to stop the ink, you push the button again, and that's going to cut off the motor. Now, you can go into the light mode here to, to kind of cure what you've made. So you can press the button twice at the bottom, and you'll see that the lights have come on. And that's what you're going to use to basically dry the ink. Uh, these lights are going to cure it so that it becomes hard and, uh, and dries, so you can actually take it off of there. And then you press the button again to turn the lights off. So from there, once you have it dried off, you can break that off here and you can pick it up. I don't know if you can see that very well, but that's our dried ink. And uh, we've actually we've created some other stuff here. My friend Ben in the studio made this little app logo. Uh, so you can just do different things with it. It's just kind of a, kind of a silly, fun toy. Um, there are definitely people who are more artistic out there than I am that can use this to create really nice works of art. I am pretty much good at drawing stick figures, so that's kind of what you get when I'm using it. But it comes with, this is the this is kind of the base kit here. It comes with three different ink cartridges. Uh, it comes with the instruction book. There's a little USB cable that comes with it to charge the battery that's built in. Um, and that's pretty much it. You get this drawing mat as well, as you can see here. The nice part about the drawing mat is it, it doesn't reflect the light. If you use it on a really bright surface, the lights, the LED lights underneath here can be pretty intense. Um, so using it on a darker surface like the mat that comes with it uh, helps just with your eyes. You, you, you don't get quite as fatigued when you're, when you're looking down actually doing your drawing. So overall, it's definitely an interesting product. Um, not really something for me just because I'm not very artistic, but if you have an artistic bone in your body and you want to do something uh, that's a little bit different, this is definitely a great quality product to check out. That is the uh, Creo Pop 3D drawing pen. Make sure you check it out at app.com. Leave your comments below. Try and be nice. And uh, be sure to like and subscribe on YouTube.